Hey, good morning everyone. This is Greg with Bad Rooster RC and I've got a new Spectrum Smart ESC that I ordered for my uh, E-Flight Mall. I uh, did a nose over in the lake and the first time it survived it but the second time the ESC got wet and it was gone. So I went ahead and ordered this to replace it. I've got the uh, Timber Night X here along with my Spectrum DX8. Now this is a nice little ESC. I've already unboxed it and kind of took a look at it, but uh, it's a nice little setup. We've got here, yeah. Uh, not much to it, not real fancy, but uh, I think it's going to work out really good. Now I'm waiting to get some Marine X, and I'm going to uh, I'm going to waterproof this one. Now I had seen some videos, and uh, they had taken like some uh, five hour epoxy and put in here and sealed this all up but I really I don't want to do that I don't want to uh, interfere with the heat dissipation in these uh, being a smart ESC or any ESC for that matter uh, so I'm just gonna put the uh, corrosion X in there and spray it down real good and, and see how that goes um, but anyway I, I looked at the instruction book and it seems pretty straightforward. Now they say on uh, Horizon Hobbies website that this is just a plug and play. And uh, oh, I've got some nice stickers in here too. So yeah, that's kind of cool. It's always a bonus to get stickers. Yeah, cool. All right, good deal. Got that in there. But the, uh, the instruction manual is pretty straightforward. I know you guys probably can't see the print, but uh, it just, uh, the table of contents kind of gives you a nice yeah, diagram there of hooking everything up whenever you're programming it. it starts out with the throttle signal installation wiring uh, so on so on ESC radio calibration now, from what I've seen it's really going to be fairly easy um, now what I'm going to do is go through and uh, program this thing and see how easy it is for me. Uh, I'm not saying I'm a brainiac, but I think anybody could really probably not have any trouble doing this. It's very well explained. Uh, it's got the programming parameters and so forth in here. So anyway, I just wanted to share this with you. I got this in uh, from FedEx here a couple days ago. Um, but we're going to try this out. This is the uh, 40 amp, 45 amp rather, I'm sorry, brushless ESC. From three to six cell and uh, I will probably be replacing um, you know any of the larger aircraft like the timbers and the mall uh, and so forth with this here I don't plan on putting my Valiant on water so I'm not too concerned about waterproofing anything uh, as far as that goes but uh, I figured um, with the uh, the mall being on floats, um, waterproofing this would be a great idea. And also, I'm probably going to take the uh, timber and pull the wing off, and, or uh, rather pull the motor out and, and, and the wing and so forth, and waterproof that ESC. Now that's got the 60 amp in it, I believe. It's a little different setup. Um, it's got reverse in it, whereas I don't believe this here has. Um, it may have. I'm not sure. I'll get into more, get more into that. Uh, I don't believe it does, though. I don't believe it has that option. But anyway, this is Greg with uh, Bad Rooster RC with the unboxing of the Avian uh, Smart ESC by Spectrum. Uh, it's got Spectrum technology, rather. So I uh, hope everybody enjoyed the video. I will uh, do another video later on the programming and see how it goes. So everybody have a great day. This is Greg with Bad Rooster RC wishing everyone a wonderful day and happy flying.